Good day. In this video, we're going to look at the theorem angle in a semicircle. We're going to do riders, four riders, four sums that uses angles in a semicircle. The four words we can use as our reasoning, we can say angle in a semicircle, we can say angle in half a circle, we can say angle on diameter. Just one of the three, get used to it and leave the others. Afrikaans, hoek op die middellijn. Of hoek en halve circle. In all these questions, they're asking us to solve for x, that small little x that you see over there. In this sum, you can see here's the diameter and the angle on the circumference on the diameter. So that is an angle in a semicircle. So we can just write x is equal to 90 degrees, our reason angle in half a circle. Some people say angle in a semicircle or angle on diameter. I'm going to stick to this one. You, you choose your own. The next question, they put the x in this corner at b here. We see the diameter, we see the angle in the semicircle, so that will be 90 degrees. Let's see how we'll write this. I started by saying angle A equals to 90 degrees, angle in half a circle. I always like to write it in on my picture, it'll help me think further. Then we write in triangle ABC, this whole triangle, the X plus the 90 plus the 58 equals to 180 degrees. A reason, interior angles of a triangle. Then we solve for x by minusing the 90 and the 58 on this side. We get x equals to 32 degrees. Please stop the video and make sure you understand how it worked and what was written. Here's our third question. They asked us to work out the value of that small x over there. Again, you can see the diameter over here and the angle in the semicircle, so there will be a 90 degrees there. Let's just see how we'll go about finding that x over there. Something else I want you to see is that there and there and there are three radii. That means this line and this line is equal. It implies that that angle and that angle is equal. This line and this line is equal. It implies that that 1 and that 36 are equal. Now let's see how we'll go about answering this question and what we will write. I wrote in triangle AOC, that's red triangle, angle A, 1, is equal to 36 degrees. In other words, that's C, because of the two radii sitting there. A lot of people have trouble with this, so make sure you catch what I'm doing. Next we write angle CAB, CAB, that angle, is 90 degrees. I also took that 36 and wrote it in there. Then we write A1 plus X equals to 90 degrees. That means 36 plus X is 90 degrees, and therefore X is 54 degrees if you minus the 36 from the 90. Please stop the video and understand what I wrote. Here is our last question of this video. We have to work out what the value of that small x is over there. Again, we see the diameter with an angle on a diameter or angle in a half a circle. There's a 90 degrees over there. I also want you to see that that line and that line is equal because they are radii. That implies that that x is equal to that angle over there. Now let's see what we write. I started in triangle DOE, that whole red triangle. I said angle D is equal to x because of the radii. Then I wrote in triangle FDE, this red one that you see now, angle D equals to 90 degrees, angle in half a circle. Then I wrote 48 degrees plus X equals to 90 degrees. Then the answer is X equals to 42 degrees, if you minus the 48 from the 90. Please stop the video and make sure you understand what I wrote. There is different ways to answer this question, but this is one way. Please indicate whether you liked or disliked this video and subscribe to the channel. If there's anything in school mathematics that you're not sure about, you can send your problem with a WhatsApp photo to this number. Then we'll look at your problem, try and solve it, and send back an answer as soon as possible for free.